here at the Belkin booth at Macworld 2013, and they are shipping uh, this month the uh, Thunderbolt dock for your Mac, which I've been waiting for for about a year or so now, so I'm very excited that it's coming out. Um, can you kind of go over what the final product's going to be? Yes, it's a Thunderbolt Express dock. So what we have here is a Thunderbolt with a do Express dock with two dis uh, Thunderbolt ports. That way you can daisy chain out to the next device. So you're basically coming in from your Mac to one of the ports and then you're daisy chaining out to another Thunderbolt device. So potentially you could have like five for a bunch of these docks and just have a bunch of ports out of it, you know. Or how many can you daisy chain through this? You can daisy chain up to six Thunderbolt devices. It also gives you um, Ethernet gigabit connectivity, FireWire 800, three USB 3.0 ports, audio in and out. does require power. That way you can spin up drives that don't have power adapters. Um, this is uh, available at the end of this month, and the price is $299. Okay. And you need power for everything, even though if you're using mobile, hard drives, uh, whatever the case, you do need the power with it? Yes. Okay. So the power for the dock only. Okay, I got gotcha. you. And then um, as far as other docks, do you foresee smaller versions that's coming out, or is this going to be your mainstay for a while now? Uh, technology at Belkin will always be improved. Um, do I anticipate uh, a additional changes to this? Uh, it's really not going to be decided by me, but uh, um, technology changes. Uh, I really couldn't say what, what the next round is, but I anticipate this since it's a brand new uh, um, communication that it'll probably be around for a while and uh, it might be expanded or changed in the future but it's going to be here for a while. That's stain, uh, aluminum just like Apple's laptops and things like that? Same brushed aluminum look, has this nice look in the front. And that, uh, that holds, is that for power uh, cord management or what's the purpose with that? Yeah, I'm showing you right here. So what we've done is we've taken this power port, Thunderbolt port, routed underneath to the back. So then what I've done is I'm going from this Thunderbolt on our dock to a Thunderbolt display and then finally to a Thunderbolt uh, drive. Okay. And do these come with Thunderbolt cable or do you have to buy one separately to get it up and running? You'd have to buy one separately. Okay. You guys ship uh, Thunderbolt cables or is it the Apple cable or what, which cable should you get with this one you think? Well, Apple's sure not making black Thunderbolt cables. Yeah. Um, but, um, yeah, the, the cables right now are, are kind of pricey, but yeah. the technology is kind of new. Yeah. That's what, but I anticipate the price of the cables to come down someday. Yeah. And as uh, I know you have some products in Apple stores, I believe. Do you, will this one eventually be in an Apple store? Or do you hope it, to make it there? Yeah, it'll be in Apple stores and uh, other distributors for Belkin as well. Okay, great. And for more information, just go to Belkin.com? Yeah, Belkin.com, and um, we'll have... Uh, there's a sign-up uh, where you can do and find out when it's going to be, be released and what vendors will have it for us. Awesome. Thank you so much.